What is going on everybody, my name is KillerMates D and welcome back to another video. Now in today's video guys, I'm going to be showing you all of the working AFK spots that you can do on the map Zombies in Space Land after the patch 1.12. Now the first one guys is located at the Kepler area. All you want to do is head over to that area, go up the steps, come to where this door barrier is, open up the door or buy the door and then you just want to go into prone and you want to edge yourself along until you get to the edge of this area. And what's going to happen is all the zombies will pile up to the left of you. Unfortunately, you can't shoot them. It is a shame. It's good if you could actually shoot them. But apart from that, it's really cool if you're in a co-op and you just want to take a break, go downstairs, get yourself a pizza or have a piss or chill out, relax, or you got to do something or you got a phone call or whatever it is, you can just sit in this prone and none of the zombies will be able to touch you and you can just get back up and we'll just walk straight out now moving on to the second one guys now the second one is downstairs under the underground you want to come to the steps you want to go on to the sixth fifth or sixth step and all you want to do is do a left strafe onto the corner of this cabinet and if you've done it correctly guys you'll land up here and you can slide along and you can probably get about three or maybe the whole team onto this little barrier and it is pretty cool and all the zombies will just walk away and it's a cool AFK. Now moving on to the third one guys. Now the third one is an AFK where you stay inside the Packer Punch. You're going to need to get yourself 25 tickets and get yourself a rewind grenade. And you're also going to have to go through all four of the teleporters in order to go through the Packer Punch. So once you've done all that, you want to go through into the Packer Punch as you can see here. And then what's going to happen is you're going to see a timer on the wall. You just want to walk around in a circle and do like two circles, loops, as you can see here. And all you're going to do then is go to the teleporter and you're going to press and hold the square button in for a second. And the moment you let go, you want to hit the rewind. And what's going to happen is it's going to rewind you back into the Packer Punch room. You're going to see the timer on the wall. It's going to go down to zero and it's going to come up with a message saying goodbye or I like to call it bye bye. And that's when you know, usually it will just kick you out. But in this case, he hasn't kicked me out. I'm inside the pack a bunch and I'm just here and I can pretty much just pack a bunch of my gun, sit in here and chill as long as you guys want. The only problem is, once you leave the pack a bunch area, you will not be able to come and do this uh, again. You won't be able to come into the pack a bunch and actually get stuck in the pack a bunch. You'd, it will go back to what it was before where there's a timer. But apart from that, it's pretty cool just to do it. If you just want to, like I said, take a break. Have a chill, uh, get yourself some food. And now finally, I'm going to be moving on to the last one, which is the fourth one. You just want to make sure that the bumper car door there is closed. You also want to make sure that this door is closed to the underground right there. And then you just want to come around to the front of where the uh, escape velocity machine is and you just want to make sure that door is closed as well now i've got it open it doesn't really matter it's just that the clowns do come through there and then you just want to come to this metal railing and you just want to stand close to it to the right of it and you just want to kill the last zombie and then when the next round starts all the zombies will be afk and they're all spawn on the opposite side of the fence and none of them will spawn here but if you do keep that one door to the underground open all the clowns, a few clowns will pop up from that area. Uh, the good thing about that though is you can probably pick up a max ammo by doing that. But So that doesn't really matter. But as long as you keep the bumper car door closed and the other one you are fine and you're good to go. If you move from this area or move too far to the left, zombies will spawn on your area. So just keep that in mind. But you can retry this on the next round as well if that happens. So I hope you guys have enjoyed today's video on all of the working AFKs on Zombies in Space and it's been Shadow Manage 3 and I'll catch you guys on the next video. Bye bye!